We hope you are having a great day, St. Louis, and it is getting pretty entertaining around St. Louis with so many things to do. As we've been mentioning all week, it is burger week, so get your hands on some burgers. But after that, you might want to relax with maybe a movie in a park or dance it off at a concert. Whatever it may be, Sarah Thompson is here to fill us in. Sarah, it's always good to see you. It's good to see you. That's a great cue. It's like it's all about indulgence. Exactly. <laughs> well, it's summer in St. Louis. Don't we worry about have anything some else. Fun. And Art Hill <laughs> film series. Let's start with that. Yes, yeah, so, you know, we talk about this one every year. Mm -hmm. This is a great event that the St. Louis Art Museum puts on right in front of the museum on Art Hill. So, you know, in the winter you sled down Art Hill, mm -hmm. but in the summer you can watch a movie for free. And it's a film series. It's kicked off last weekend. The remaining dates are there, the 21st and the 28th. Each year they do a theme. Mm -hmm. So this year's theme is education. Okay. I think that times out with the 100th anniversary of their education programs at the St. Louis Art Museum. And it also ties into one of their exhibits. So you can check out this Friday. Do you remember a Kila and the Bee? I do, with yeah. With Kiki Palmer. That mm -hmm. was the two, 2006 film uh, with Kiki Palmer, Lawrence Fishburne, and Angela Bassett. That's going to be this Friday. And then School of Rock is next oh, Friday. Fine. And so the film starts at 9, but you can get there at 6, and there's food trucks and drinks and a bunch of stuff where people just kind of chill out. Yeah. <laughs> Again, indulge, have fun. Why not? Not think about anything mm -hmm. else, but no, have a great time. And what's great about this is it's free, too. So if you want to balance out your summer activities mm -hmm. free and paid, this is a good one. I was on the Hollywood Casino Amphitheater website earlier this week, and I was blown away by how many artists are coming to I St. Know. Louis just there tonight, Chris Stapleton, Chris Stapleton. but there's some other really big concerts yeah, going on too. I mean, too. summer, it's so, um, I think about this a lot, so Americana, right, mm -hmm. where you're like summer concerts, and I think everyone has memories from high school, college, and even adulthood of going to them, so we wanted to mention some of the big summer mm -hmm. concerts. Uh, you mentioned Chris Stapleton tonight at Hollywood Casino Amphitheater, and then Friday night at uh, Enterprise Center is Alicia Keys, Ooh. and this is the big keys to summer tour, and I think, you know, from all the reviews that I've read and even some of the stuff I've seen with her interviews, she's saying this is her favorite tour to date. This is her si seventh concert tour. And what's really neat about this is they have a whole 360 degree oh, stage. Perfect. Yeah, and so that's really cool mm -hmm. for that one. And then if that's not enough, if you want to flip back over to the country music side, mm -hmm. Cody Johnson's Friday night at Chaffetz Arena. Um, last I checked, there were still tickets available, mm -hmm. but they were scooped up. You know, again, yeah. it's the summer. He's such a big up and comer. Yes, yes. Yeah. So that's Friday. And then just to put on your calendar, switching music gears, 50 Cent is going to be here on his The Final Lap Tour okay. uh, with Busta Rhymes mm -hmm. and Jeremiah, and that's on Tuesday back out at Hollywood Casino Amphitheater. And then that's followed. We had to end on a note for anyone from reality TV mm -hmm. to heavy metal days to just rock. Brett Michaels. <laughs> Brett Michaels and his party grad tour is going to be next Friday at Hollywood C Casino Amphitheater. And they've actually got a, a good lineup of, you know, some of the mm -hmm. opening acts that people will uh, recognize from Jefferson Starship to uh, Mark McGrath. Do you remember from Sugar Ray? I do, Sugar yeah. Ray? Absolutely. And some others and stuff. So these are just the big ones. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think everyone in St. Louis has some memory, you know, of out course. of the amphitheater mm -hmm. and some of the other places just to do those summer concerts. I've so. seen Brett Michaels live and I touched his hand <laughs> and it was pretty awesome. <laughs> it, really it was bad. it was great. I'll but show you, you the video. His hand, like, I did, it. I did, I did. I was like this. <laughs> And he reached, and every rose has its thorn, and Brett has my heart. We will post this segment at gaymovie.com slash great day following the show. You weren't expecting that, were you? I, I was not. I was totally <laughs> thinking, oh, my God, like that Rock of Love show and mm -hmm. stuff. That was a good story. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. All right. Good stuff, Kent. Thank you, ladies.